tastes like chicken. No chicken. Tastes like fish. Gentlemen, contain yourselves. This quarrel sells our feast. Besides, tastes like pork. And what surprise is this? Brothers, look here. I have eyed yet another prize. Fortune favors our bellies. Stranger, be you friend or food. The mark is her measure. Show us the brand of the absolute. Am I not astonishing? A robust diet makes for a shrewd mind, you see. I am a gourmand. And you, a delicacy. Unless you bear the mark, of course. Indeed. How regrettable that your meat must go unsavored. Food? Food. Not food. Friend. We follow the sense of blood and gold to all lands fertile, friend. And this land proves particularly fruitful. I've no use for the Absolute, or any god. I follow two masters only, gluttony and greed. The goblins understand my appetites. They sate my hunger for gold, and the rest sate my hunger for meat. Boss Goblin give gold. We check brand. Good deal. No talk. Okay, so whoever has uh, taken a good look at these guys and still decides that this option attack is a good idea, uh, then the dead poor must have completely rotted their brains, because that is the least likely option anyone would pick, I think. Anyone sensibly would pick, I think, in this situation. Yet it's there, that's why I love this game. So many options, even if they're incredible. Anyway, continue. I am, by all accounts, a student of higher commerce and extortion. Make me an offer. Tempt me. Slip of the tongue. You meant to make a better offer, surely. A serenade to my ears and a boon to my belly. We've a bargain, my tasty kibble. Take my bone horn. One blow, and the ground will quake with my family name. Use it when the need arises, and never a moment before. Ogre kill everyone around, then Ogre eats them. Well spoken, indeed. Ogre kill everyone around. We will keep close when you are ready. Sound the horn. 